Hey guys, it's Melissa. I'm just going to do a quick video on how to use the free designs that you get from designbundles.net. This week it is this dinosaur file. I will link in the description exactly where you can grab this file for free. It has three days and a few hours left and comes with all of these different dinosaurs. I really like this for print and cut, so I just want to show you how to use this for print and cut inside the Silhouette software. The first thing you're going to do is find your file and open up the one you want to use. I will go ahead and use this PNG. Now it comes pretty large, so you're going to want to resize it. And right now, if you try to turn cut lines on um, this file, it's going to put a cut line around the whole box. So basically this file just has a clear background, so it's telling you all we see is just the shape of the whole entire file as if you were going to print it on a computer. So we want to change this to no cut. We want to create a cut line around the outline. That way we can print out this file. and When we send it to Silhouette, it will cut directly around the outline of the file. So we're going to go to our trace window, select the trace area, which will be around the whole design. And we're going to turn the high pass filter off and just turn the threshold all the way up. So we want everything to be yellow and then we are going to do trace outer edge. So basically all it's going to do is just trace around the design. Now you can separate these two at this point and you can see if you go with your fill bucket and fill in this area that it is filled in. It's a solid color. I'm going to hit command C to go back and put these two back together because I want to make sure they're grouped together. Then we'll hit command G. So now if you go ahead and do your print and cut features, you're going to print this off on the computer and we'll have the code set up. I'll do that in another tutorial. And when you send this to Silhouette, it will cut exactly around the lines on this dinosaur. Okay guys, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask them in the comments below. I'll get the print and cut tutorial up soon as well. That way you can actually see step-by-step -step how to do that part too. All right, thanks guys.